Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. Today I'm just doing a little vlogging. It's like 4:19 right now, and I'm just getting around to do some filming. Uh, been busy getting stuff gathered up, camera equipment, whatnot. Cause I'm bringing a lot of camera stuff. So I'll show you some of the important stuff we got out here. Of course, this is not everything, but this is just some of the stuff I may need or will need. So check this out. Alright, so first, we've got, we're going to be bringing an inverter. I have two, three more. I might bring another one, but we're going to be bringing uh, an inverter. Now, I know she's been wanting these. If you guys remember, I did a review on these, these Bushnell um, binoculars. I did a review on them. Uh, I had this for sale for five bucks. Was it five bucks? Yeah, for five bucks. And a guy, a friend of mine, Ryan, he said, wow, that'll fit. I got these nice little binoculars. These are Tascos. He said, uh, mind if I see if they'll fit in there? I said, no, go right ahead. And he checked, and they fit in that case perfectly. So he bought the case off of me. And, oh, I don't know, a few months later, so you can clip it on your belt. A few months later... He said, hey, want them binoculars? I never use them. I said, yes, so he gave them to me. So I don't know which one she's going to want to bring, if she wants to bring this one or this one. So whichever one she wants to bring for when we're on the boat. We've got our tackle box. There's a lot of stuff in there. Uh, it's supposed to rain, so I've got some of this, you know, these wet fire stuff. i got these knives. Hopefully, we'll be able to try them out, do a review on them. Those are umbrellas for our chairs. And we've got a couple flashlights here. This thing's badass, man. What do you guys see this after dark? This thing is bright and shines a good ways. It's only one LED. Crazy. Uh, we've got, got a selfie stick in here. I've got... This, I made this for Monkey out of a tripod and the bottom feet here will extend out so she can, you know, set it down on something. I made this. So I guess it's just a unipod. Uh, this has got our uh, ghost meter thing in it. You never know, right? Uh, this is the tripod that we made for the light. This is another tripod. This tripod is a new one I bought from Monkey. Uh, it's the same brand as my mic up here. Um, so this is cool. It's got a handle on it. She likes it because she can hold the handle. It's got its own little bag. Uh, Here's the tripod that I use for the camera I'm using right now. Uh, let me see. Also have another little tripod here. This extends out and is as big as that one once it's extended. It's a chrome one. I did a review on that, I do believe. This has got this has got all like it's got the battery chargers it's got um, extra batteries um, the IR illuminator um, just all that kind of stuff all my extra lenses for the cam for this camera um, uh, voice recorders got all kinds of stuff in it this has uh, three more cameras in it it's got an old night vision Sony uh, takes the disc it's got uh, the JVC the newer camera and it's got our uh, GoPro in there and so we're good to go there and I like this thing we went to Ikea and it's been a couple years ago and uh, was looking for a, a range hood and uh, we saw these, they were 20 bucks. And she said, you should get one, put your camera stuff in. You can 
carry it this way or the handle pulls out. It's got wheels on it. I almost didn't get it. She was like, no, get one. I said, all right. I use that thing a lot, especially when we're going places. This is her new cup. I got this. This is not paracord, okay? This is just, it's cordage. Um, just a little rope. I got three of these. These you can buy at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. I mean, what the hell? We're going camping. I may need them. Of course, Monkey's uh, camera that I gave her, I've got her, her charger in there. I've got her two extra memory cards. I've got her two extra batteries so she's got three batteries three memory cards this is the light that i let her use she doesn't need it a lot but so we're going to be bringing this so we've got plenty of lights plus our you know lights on our our flashlights on our phone so there's that i'll show you what we're doing outside um This is all yard sale stuff here, guys. Well, except for, I'm only bringing the two fishing poles or two chairs. There's our tent. Yeah, this, all this stuff here, yard sale stuff. Flea market stuff, whatever you want to call it. I've got, okay, we've got this cooler. We have another one in the garage. Um, this thing works off your battery. Needs cleaned up. Um, this works great. I left it plugged in for a couple days with a pop in it and it froze it. So we've got our extra can of gas, which is not gonna be in the boat, of course. We're, we'll take it out and put it in the truck, but it's in here for now. Got my funnel. That tank is full. This tank is the one we put four gallons in. And up here, I've got the main battery charged for the lights and up here is our second battery it's a little one it's charging it should be just about charged yes it's very close about 90 percent charged i'll go ahead and flip it on two amp trickle um see i gotta put weight up here because if when i have it because see when, when when we park it you know i raise the front end up so in case any water gets in it can roll to the back and run out this tire is still holding air as you can see though it's dry crack but it'll be good enough for a spare um, so when she gets done with her running today uh, I'll back the truck in and we'll hook up that way when we leave because we're heading that way and when we leave in the morning we're gonna have everything packed tonight and ready to go all we got to do is get in the truck and head on out so that's what I'm doing so I got our jackets in here I was using that earlier um, I'm gonna be bringing this this grill it's the same one as this but I'm gonna bring this one this one's that one's never been used uh, buddy of mine dropped that off um, we're gonna uh, I don't know I don't even know if it runs we're gonna check it out and everything uh, we can get it running and and sell it uh, there's our minnow bucket I don't know if we're gonna be using minnows um, but I will be bringing that and possibly that I don't think we'll need that because we each have a life vest Bruno's got one and that she can use as a cushion or it's also a flotation device so <laughs> that's what i'm doing we're getting closer to being ready uh she messaged me a little bit ago and said she had two more patients and then she'll be um on her way home well and then she's got to go to the store and get the food that we need and then she'll be on her way home. I'm gonna make sure these tires have enough air. They look low, but I don't think they are. But I'll check them later on. And I think we're pretty much ready to go. You guys remember Eli when he was a baby? That's him now. Yeah. 
That's little Eli. Need some water. Cool. So, that's what we got going on. So I'm pretty much ready. You know, and then like I said, I'll, I'll go ahead and put the cover back on it. And, um, and we'll be ready to go, hopefully. Um, I mean, we still gotta pack our clothes, load the truck, and you know, um, pack the coolers and get them iced down. I think they'll be all right overnight. Um, that way we don't have to do it first thing in the morning. So, but I may just put everything we're gonna be taking into the fridge that's in the garage, and then all I gotta do is just throw the food in there I think this one's going to be I'm not sure yet I, I think this one's going to be for the drinks you know or pop and whatnot and I think she's going to bring some water probably I'm going to bring some beers and then and, and but the the cooler that's in the garage I'm glad I didn't cut it up yet it's it's an old meat cooler that the guys in the trucks used to sell meat out of what is it Omaha is that is that the name of it but it's a big cooler. I'll probably put the food in that because I had one in Ohio. And I'll tell you what, that thing, psh, all weekend long, uh, four days of camping. And and I'll tell you what, there'll still be ice in it on the fourth day. So, all right, I'll be back with you guys in a second. I'm gonna go double check a few things. And then once we load the truck is when I'll start checking off the list of everything. But I'm gonna go through my list and see See if I'm forgetting anything, so I'll be back with you guys. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> okay, guys, as you can see, Bruno's getting excited. That's about all I got for you today, just some simple stuff, you know. It, like I said, it's mostly camera gear. Uh, I film a lot when I'm out there. I also got the, the panoramic head, you know, for the that you put a tripod head that um, that'll go back and forth and you know film we'll get some footage for for you of that I don't have a drone my drone quit working a while back so I won't be able to get any drone footage for you sorry about that but anyway so uh, monkey's got one more patient it is now 558 and then she's got to go to the store and then she'll be home so I'm about whipped for today so I'm gonna get off here and let you guys go. Remember, uh, if you don't see a live stream, don't don't be alarmed. But I'll have something up for you on Monday, I'm sure. So anyway, you guys have a great weekend. Stay safe. Shea Bear, the Myth, the Man, the Legend. I'm gone for now. And Bruno, he is out for now. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. Bye bye and take care.